All right, so what I did here is I separated walls, hallways, ceilings, and floors. Okay, now um, everything is the same height this way. Uh, if you look at this, you know, I did all the UVs, but I did all the UVs based upon cylindrical mapping on the walls, and then all the hallways, and then the floors and ceilings were uh, planar mapped. But what's really nice about this is, if if you think about texture space for a second, this is a perfect one-on-one -on -one texture space right now. Okay? So what I'm going to do here is take it and ruin that a little bit. But what I'm going to do is align all the floors or all the, the actual walls together. Just like that. So this represents all the walls. Now, based upon texture resolution, what would ha what will happen here is I could shrink this down. And then technically, I can scoot it in. But now what I'm going to have to do is learn how to tile my textures. And right now, by doing this, some um, texture locations on here, you know, are just maybe a little bit smaller than they would used to. But, you know, you have to do what you have to do to get a level done. Uh, and you want the ability to move around the texture quite a bit. So, because we, we haven't even decided on textures yet. We've just decided... These are walls, okay? And keep in mind, you know, there's there's many ways to do this also. You know, if you, if you like my method, that's fine. If you don't like the method, you know, just you know, kind of look at it like, uh, you know, this is another way to do stuff. Okay, again, I'm going to shrink these down. I'm going to shrink them down right in the center first. And I can technically move these these parts together a little bit more. That gives me a lot of room here to move this stuff around. It gives me a lot of room here to move these around. Because I still haven't decided on textures. I still want to keep these islands as far apart as possible um, without ruining a whole bunch of resolution. Leaving these big bulky chunks here. For right now, what I want to do... Is kind of arrange these in you know some kind of fashion. And it would help maybe if I can keep these two about the same size. So I'm going to kind of scale this back up to about the same size. Okay. And if I need to scale them, what I can do is grab both of them at the same time and scale them together. So these are going to be at a different tile ratio than these and hopefully a 2048 map should handle all these textures now again it's all about how much space there is so obviously the walls are going to be a higher res than the floor which is kind of sad but um, that's what kind of way I chunked it out but one map running let's say a uh, one map of 4096 or 2048 running the entire show is better than like 15 maps all running the show. So there we go. 
All right, that gives me some leeway. And then in the next video, let's start kind of looking at textures for a minute and see how they work.